Hey folks, Steve here, Synthro Tech and Sound City Modular. Today we are talking about a new uh, module we're launching, which is called the Vid Mix. Um, it is the compendium to the Vid Picks, but it doesn't need to use the Vid Picks in order for you to use its full great functions. Basically, it is a high speed op amp video RCA video mixer and that's a crossfader as well and uh, with CV control also an automatic just uh, immediate switch button here that allows you to kind of bring in both signals at the same time for some of that glitch video so it's very very great for glitch video let's put on the CRT that I have here I'm mixing some of the vid pick signal indirectly with a movie and you can see if I go all the way up here on the mixer let's bring it over here if I go all the way up I've got one signal if I go all the way down. I've got this signal, um, which is our movie here. Uh, like I said, of course, you can kind of mix between those as you see. You can just use it as a very simple mixer, and that's very cool in its own right. Again, uses those expensive high-speed op amps, so it lets you to mix video. But what's also cool about it, it is a dirty video mixer, right? So if we get this thing kind of in the middle, you're going to start having some of that glitch video that we all love in our uh, vaporwave tendencies here, which allow you to do uh, very, very cool things. Of course, you could use another mixer uh, to do chroma key in there, and then things get obviously a lot more wild. So you don't have to have um, two vid picks in order to mix together. You can just have two VCRs, two video cameras, things like that, and then you can kind of mix between those. But what's very neat about it is it also is, like I said, CV controlled. Let's turn up a very simple, I'm gonna unplug uh, channel two out of our uh, vid mix here. So it gets this kind of VCA-like effect when we bring in like an envelope or something into the CV, if we put that all the way down, we can, we can have video come in kind of in a neat glitch like this, depending on what your television, how fast it reacts. Sometimes if it goes to the blue screen, it ends up being a little bit more difficult. But if you can get it on old CRT where it brings in, if you bring in like an audio, you'll see, and this isn't obviously very complex, you can bring in your video according to a beat, which is um, just a blue. which is very very cool. Now, if I you know lengthen an envelope or something like that, of course it's going to be there for longer. But man, that is very cool. And of course, with the vid picks, we can kind of change whichever eight bit graphic you like. Um, if we take out. It brings in, like I said, it brings it in fast with like what you're doing. Now, of course, it, it is vectoral based, so it's not exceedingly light speed fast, but it is fast and it gives you a really, really cool technique. Now, of course, you could also plug in um, your other video source here and be bringing this in over your video source when that when it comes up. Or, not, of course, don't have anything in that channel two or channel one, depending on where you have it. It ends up being, like I said, like kind of like it brings in your video in a VCA-like way. And of course, you can bring it kind of like half, so it's sort of, let me bring this over here. You're gonna have it halfway up or so to taste, so it's already kind of glitchy. But then it brings in that other video source um, like that. So it's a pretty simple module. You could use it for audio too. Um, it'll work. It'll work like a uh, uh, like a VCA here or like a crossfading VCA. But because it is um, set up for high speed video, um, you don't have to get very far into video synthesis for things to get really kind of fun and very very cool. Um, anyway, thanks for checking this out. It's a pretty simple module, like I said, 3 HP, but it does things that are very cool, lets you animate, perfect for a live set. Put these projections on yourself according to a beat that you want to put in from some of your music or something like this. Um, and you're going to have uh, uh, a, a performance vehicle that is so much more interesting than just audio. So anyway, check it out. It's reasonably priced, 100 bucks built. 
kits, of course, are cheaper, and we have PCB panels. And we want to let you know, um, Merry Christmas during this holiday season. Happy New Year, and uh, be paying attention to our fun Black Friday things this weekend. And make sure you get a vid mix. You might be able to get one for free. Anyway, thanks for watching.